The city of Boise says it will pay to demolish two unsafe homes on Altavia Court. What some say is an act of altruism. Others suggest it's an opportunity to destroy evidence. Six on your side's Roland Barris has tonight's big story. Get one clarification. The city is clear. The homes on Alto Via Court are dangerous. And these homes and the huge crevasses that uh, exist here are, are a danger to both the public and firefighters and police officers. Despite the fact that the worst of the homes has been fenced off, the city ruled the homes must be removed or demolished. It is very unsafe. Initially, the city was going to charge the homeowners who already suffered the indignity of losing their homes without compensation. But the city had a change of heart. I'm very happy on behalf of you know our clients that they're not going to have to bear the cost on this. Still, counsel for the homeowners says the demolition could hurt his case against the city for a allowing the homes to be built there in the first place. If these homes are destroyed, if topsoil stabilization measures are put in play, whatever that means, is it going to alter the evidence? And if it does, does that impair our ability, our experts, to go up there and do additional testing to rebut whatever the defendants say? A judge recently gave until August 10th for the plaintiffs to gather evidence from the site, but after that, the city can destroy a key piece of evidence, and Nicholson says he may have to use that in court. It's certainly possible that at some point in time, we will request the, the court to give an instruction to any jury that there is an adverse inference to be taken from the d d destruction because the city has required destruction of evidence. Roland Barris, six on your side.